Hi guys, I'm back to do a really huge haul today. It has been a while, I haven't been here showing you what I've bought for my kids and friends and relatives, but now I've accumulated quite a bit of stuff. So I'm gonna go through it all. I've got things from Zara, I've got things from Bowdoin, and of course Primark. Nobody can forget Primark, uh, especially not in the summertime. Well, that's what I think anyway. Got my mug of coffee, got my mug, always have to have my coffee. And uh, I'll just put this down and then I'll show you what I've got. Well, first off, we've got um, some relatives who live in a hot climate. So I popped into Primark and I bought some items, quite a lot of items. They've got some fantastic stuff at the moment. Uh, it's for two little girls. So I'll start off firstly with the first thing. So I've got this beautiful pink, white and a blue trim swimsuit with polka dot for only two pounds fifty i mean it's amazing amazing so um lovely little swimsuit um really good quality um it even sits it's, it's lined on the front as well for two pounds fifty so i bought her this lovely little swimsuit and then i thought at the beach she might want to cover up with a play suit so got that and let's show you the play suit. Here we go. I got them, um, the little girl in question's only five, but her mummy's probably got lots of things already, as you do. So I bought them in a six, age six to seven, because I thought, well, if they're too small, it's a bit of a disaster, because you spent all that money posting it there. But if it's too big, she can pop it away in the drawer for later. So again, 100% uh, cotton. I've got this lovely little play suit, which is not too short, you know, uh, um, cover her modesty. Um, and it's got this lovely elasticated waist. So um, I think it'll be pretty comfortable. So if they want to wear that on the way back from the beach, she can pop that over her swimsuit. I also thought it'd be nice to just get a little t-shirt for, um, you know, again, pop it over the swimsuit. Again, fantastic, £1.50, fantastic, the Primark t-shirts. You can't beat them. So I've got this lovely cat. So we're a reminder of Safi, our pussy cat. So she's got that pink t-shirt. And then I thought I'd get an outfit. So I've got this lovely flowy top and this beautiful skirt, which has got elephants on. And there is a, there is a clue. Think about the elephants. Um, pockets, because my kids love pockets, hence the fact I'm always unloading loads of stuff from their pockets before it goes in the washing machine. Today I found my son Oscar's memory stick in his uh, pocket, so I was glad I managed to haul that out before it went through the cycle, um, costing me another sort of eight, 10 quid. So um, here we go. So she can tuck that in, lovely and flowy, because it's very hot where they live. So that's the outfit. I will remove all the hangers, obviously, because that will cost in the post. But what I do, this is my little trick for presents, um, I do sometimes wrap them in paper, but they've got these really lovely little bags at Primark, and they've got this one, like I said, with the elephants on, and I thought that would match the skirts. We've got some sort of theme going there. Um, and this ele this bag cost 150 and the wrapping paper was 150 so I thought, I'm going to buy these and pop all the items in the clothes, and then they've got a little beach bag to take with them. Um, lovely little bow on there, and uh, this is for the older daughter, I think it's a bit more sophisticated. So nice cloth bag and a uh, nice gift ready to go, already wrapped. And for her little sister, I'll show you what I got for her little sister. Again, I got her a pretty little t-shirt, um, and they're quite, they've got lovely dark hair and dark eyes, so I think these bright colours look beautiful on them. Very pretty, 100% cotton again, so a little t-shirt. And then I also got, let's go through my little pile here, I also got a cute swimsuit. So this one's got fruit on it and a nice, like, I think it's yellow or lime green trim. So again, it's, it's just really cute and £2.50. Um, the play suit, which I got for the little one, again, elasticated waist, white with neon pink butterflies. This is only three pounds, as was the other play suit. And so they don't argue, because I know people might argue they've got exactly the same outfit, just in different colors. I got her the little pink top, which is, uh, let's see, two pounds 50, can't complain. 
and I got this lovely little skirt again with the pockets again 250 I mean five pounds for an outfit what's great about it is you don't have to be precious about it you can just wear them and then chuck them in the washing machine don't have to worry that they're safe for best and for her I got this little bag which is a pussycat wearing pink glittery sunglasses <laughs> to carry to the beach and on the back it's got little pussy cats and again 150 so I'll pop that all in that bag and they're good to go so that is all a present um, we don't go wild on the cost of the clothes because it actually costs rather a lot of money to post it to this particular country but hey ho so I will pack items in a box up to the total of two kgs and then send that off and, and hope it arrives because it has been known for things to go missing so pop those to one side now you may be asking did I get my kids anything in Primark this time well I did but not very exciting I'm afraid because they've got some stuff I ordered from Zara so Tabitha let's lean down got some wildly exciting socks for £2.50 which um, she doesn't really like socks she says they're too tight anyway I've got some socks I got them in a really big size so hopefully she won't complain who knows and then for Oscar I got him uh, two sets of their trunk fitted boxes uh, four pounds each so about what's that one pound thirty for a pair of her pants so he should be happy so um, again I get I get them when they got the dark colors in they do like neon ones and all sorts but he he likes the more conservative ones so I've got those for him and you might ask did I get something for mummy when well, I did actually because uh, you know what it's like in Primark you go in for one thing and you end up you know coming out with uh, this sort of damage very big bags <laughs> so mummy came out with quite a few bags as well got myself some staples for the summer um, here we go I got these these are six pounds pair of tennis shoes can't go wrong so I thought got a white pair yep I got a navy pair so I got the navy pair as well so you know basically at the end of the summer if they're totally totaled then I shall just biff them because um, they'll be fine and let's face it white shoes eh, how long don't know how long they'll stay white so we're going on holiday soon so I thought I'd get some stuff and um, we're actually going on Eurostar so um, we're going to be doing quite a bit of walking and then I got three swimsuits because I looked at the fitting rooms in Primark and the queue was massive so I thought no just buy them Sam try them on at home which a will be less embarrassing b less depressing and I can take back the ones that don't work um, went for two boring ones conservative ones we'll see which ones I end up keeping so put them all on my lap and this is what we've got um these are let's see how much money were these where's the label oh, 13 pounds in fact I think they were all 13 so I got this blue and white one um which I think is quite stylish I mean you'd see these a lot more money in other shops um, nice halter neck I like that because you know holds you up and supports you so inside it's got a sort of hidden hidden bra so that's that's great so I haven't tried these yet so I'm not sure how we'll go it's got a bit of this ruching um, to I think hide anything you may want to hide <laughs> and then I've got this one um, again blue and white my favorite combo I love blue and white clothing this is 13 pounds as well um, it's got the halter neck which I really I really like if you're you know a little bit big up top and again it's got this nice bra strap at the back to hold you in so nothing offensive there and it's got these sort of cute cute little buttons on the front quite like that detail now keep your mind open on this one <laughs> I saw it and I thought mm, I don't know and then I thought oh why not just go for it because you know 1950s style I really like so put your sunglasses on I bought this yes I know it's a bit different but I absolutely love it so it's super cute it's got the bow at the top you can take off the gold bling if you want to leave it on depends how you roll um, inside it's got like a mesh a mesh top and it's got padded slightly padded bust and it's got this lovely flowy skirt at the bottom and I tried it on when I got home it's the only one I've tried on and it's really cute 
Um, my son said, you're not going to swim in that, are you? <laughs> I said, well, I'm, I might do. Um, but it's probably going to be for lying in state on the sun lounger and reading my Kindle. So who knows, but I really like him. For £13, I think you can afford, you know, to take a risk. If you spend loads of money on something that's a bit out there and you never wear it, you feel a bit bitter. But I think I might actually keep this, even if I wear it, oh, I don't know, just on holiday. You know, I think it's really cute. So I'm really pleased with those. And you can't go wrong at that price. It's just ridiculous. It's so good. So pop those in the bag. Um, oh, talking about... A little bit boring item again but essential for Tabitha um, again underwear this time from Bowden from mini Bowden and I believe I've bought loads of underwear for my daughter from when we lived in New Zealand from bonds in Australia from those brands they used to be quite good but yeah okay uh, Marks and Spencer's Primark whatever but these knickers are brilliant they're just absolutely brilliant they are not cheap. I'll 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 say that they're not cheap, but they are beautiful. Um, these ones I've got are in store basically for when she grows into them. They're the next size up, and uh, she did find them and wore, wore one pair, and they fell off because they were so big. But um, they're just brilliant. I don't know what it is. I think it's the cut of them um, and the cotton. They're just really great round the back. They don't you know all hang out so to speak. And they do lovely patterns. These ones got cupcakes. At the moment, they've got stripes and rabbits. And she's had these, probably buy two packs of these to last her for a year, whatever, year and a half. Um, they are expensive. They're listed, these ones, because they're a bigger size, are listed at £26. And you all go, oh, that's ridiculous. But what I do is I usually buy them when they have 25% off. And then I buy them through Quidco as well, which gives me another 5%. So, in fact, I got this pack um four and how many's in a pack i think it's seven in a pack one two three four five yes yeah, seven because there's one pair in the wash seven pairs for about 18 pounds if you take off the 30 percent. but i can honestly tell you they wash well they're brilliant and she always says they're really comfortable so it's her little luxury and they come in this really cute matching bag with mini bowden written on so i even though they're not you know cheap as chips I would highly recommend them and I shall continue to buy them until of course probably when she's a teenager she'll be saying oh, I want something like Victoria's Secret hmm, you know what the answer will be but hey ho we'll keep this going uh, while we get away with it so that's that what else did I get oh yes my favorite well oh wait a minute I've forgotten something <laughs> how about this for three pounds Look at this beautiful hat I got for Tabitha for our holiday because our last holiday she wore a baseball cap all the time belonging to her brother and I thought not very girly it's not very cute it's all right so I thought oh, I'd like to get her a hat so when I went into Primark I saw these beautiful little hats and it, it's really good quality three pounds and it looks so cute on her you'll probably see her wearing it in videos that's if she'll wear it I hope she will um, they had other ones. They had a hessian one with peach flowers all the way around, but this is the one I chose because we'd probably only end up wearing one. But they are wonderful. Pop in and get them before they sell out. So that was the last thing from Primark. Don't think it fits mummy, does it? No. If it did, I'd get one for myself, but hey ho. So Primark and internet shopping. Being on the internet, Bowden's over the internet, of course. Primark, you have to go in and come out you know with all your bags Zara again I love Zara internet shopping not the sale yet of course I'll be waiting avidly for that but this is a big box of stuff I got for Tabitha for the summer and this is what we'll go with this summer so I love Zara for internet shopping they have a beautiful packing and no exception this time Look at it, it's fantastic. It all comes wrapped in tissue paper with a little sticker that says Zara and it's just wonderful. And it turns up really quick. It's free delivery over 50 pounds. So even if you don't want to spend 50 pounds, I, I, I might duplicate something so I get the free delivery and then just return the thing that I don't want because it's um, free returns, why not? So let's have a look what we've got. Oh, it's great already. 
So I went into the store to check out, do a bit of research of what I like, because I find the, the website sometimes, um, I can't really see what the fabric is or whether it's going to be good or whether the colours all match up. So I went into my local store, checked out what I wanted, came home and ordered it all online. So here we go, beautifully packed in the box. I'm really excited because I know these all really look cute on her. So what did we get? I bought some outfits. So starting with just a cotton t-shirt, um, a cotton cardigan button down the front. The only thing I find about Zara, Tabitha's nine years old and this is age nine to ten and I find it comes up quite large on her but of course it depends what size your kid is. So um, this is lovely cotton so hopefully it will it wash well and how much was this? This was 11 99 so call it 12 quid um, and I just think it's lovely and the reason I got it, I'll put it up on the back here, I hope you can still see it because I've chosen an outfit. I've chosen this beautiful t-shirt for her to wear with it, which I think is adorable. It's plain on the back, but it's got this broidery anglaise on the front. And this costs 6 99 so seven quid. And I thought that would be great underneath. And then when she gets cold, she can pop on the cardigan. So that all matches, you can see it all goes. And then I got these beautiful shorts. Not too short, because I don't like them when, you know, bottoms hanging out or anything. So she's got these, and these were 12 to 13 pounds, and they're that fabulous stretch denim, uh, because Tabitha always says, I don't like anything too tight. Um, sorry, this is really comfortable, and it's really soft denim. So again, let's see, has it got an adjustable waist? Yes, it does, which is great for my little one. So got the uh, adjustables here. And this is the outfit I want her to wear it with, so it all matches. And then if I want a ping of colour, I've got my eye on a lovely cotton scarf I've seen in Primark that I might buy. So where's the hat? I think my cutie pie will look really nice in that outfit. I like the peach coral colour so much, I got it in yellow. So again, I've got the yellow cotton cardigan. Although this size is too big, I'm going to swap it out maybe when one gets a return because it's always good to look out if you're internet shopping. If it doesn't have it in stock that day, someone like myself might have ordered two different sizes and then you return one and you go back and get the one. So I'm going to go and get a smaller size, but I just wanted to see if the colour matched, which it does. So up goes the yellow cardigan up there. And again, here we go. I got the yellow t-shirt with the beautiful broider anglaise, which I, I just love it. And it's good because you can't see skin, it's, um, it's got lining behind the uh, lace, so everything's all covered. So she's got this and that goes, as you can see, with the cardigan. And the creme de la creme is these shorts, which mummy loves. I don't know if madam's going to like them, but I love them. And they are just beautiful. And they were they were $17.99, so £18 obviously, a bit more expensive, but I figure they will look absolutely gorgeous for days out. So I'm gonna pop those with the cardigan with this t-shirt, and there is a beautiful scarf at Zara, which is yellow but with big cream polka dots, which I have my eye on, which will probably end up with this outfit. And again. The hat from Primark for three pounds fits beautifully. They do have some hats at Zara, but seriously, the ones at Primark are fantastic. No need to go the extra mile and pay the 10 pounds or whatever. So this is my favorite outfit. I will uh, introduce all this gear to Tabitha tomorrow and see if she likes it, but I love it. And then there was one last thing that was a fun item and I thought I've got to get it for her um, because Tabitha loves animals. So I bought her this t-shirt, which I thought would look really nice with a pair of denim shorts over jeans. And I've actually, I'm actually bidding on a um, Zara denim jacket on eBay at the moment, which I'm hoping I win. And then she can pop it over this stuff and give it like the nice cash look. So this one has got zebras on it, giraffes. It's got a hippo with a little bird on it. Uh, what else is on there? Butterfly, a cheetah. So lovely and big and airy. So I thought that would be cute. And again, it goes with the hat. So I'm actually quite chuffed with my haul this time. I did a, quite a bit of research 
and waited to get exactly what I wanted and uh, I I'm pleased with it because I think sometimes if you don't think about what you get you can go wild and there's so much cute stuff out there for kids I mean oh, you can just you walk through a shop and you see more and more cute stuff and what I've said to myself I've said look Sam, there's always going to be more and more cute stuff because if you walk into another shop, you go into John Lewis and you'll see even more cute and cute stuff. So I just thought, no, what does she need? Let's try and keep a capsule collection. Sounds flash, doesn't it? And just get the things you really love. And I have them in the house for about a week. And if I feel not very strongly about them after a week, I take them back because otherwise you're always going to pick the things you love best and not use the ones that you're like meh about. Um, did I get myself something in Zara? Did mummy get herself something? I did. I got myself a little jumper and this is it. Again, my theme of loving navy and white and cream. I got this little jumper here, stretch and um, it looks really good with jeans, so I've already worn this actually about three times. It looks great with a blazer, it looks great with a denim jacket, with a leather jacket, and I just pop it on with jeans and it looks great. And this was $19.99. Uh, I've got a little button detail at the back. These come in, I think they came in just plain navy, it came in cream. Uh, my friend I was with bought all three. I just bought this one at the moment and then of course I did happen to go over to the sale rail. Not sure if I'm keeping this yet but I found this skirt in the sale for £12 with a rouge top and I thought these two look quite cute together. The only thing is it's quite heavy, it's more for winter so I might just pop it in my Heidi place and I can wear it with opaque tights and boots come winter. So it was 26 originally and it had 50% off. So I bought that. I mean, I couldn't leave it there, could I? I had to sort of save it. It was looking a bit lonely on the shelf. So that's my haul. Quite a big haul. I don't do this shopping all the time. But what I got, I'm actually quite pleased with. I'm quite happy. I got quite a bit of stuff. Now, you may be wondering, poor Oscar only got two packs of underwear. This is true. But he said to me, he said to me, I don't want any clothes at the moment. I've got loads of clothes. All I need is a pair of surf shorts. So we're on the hunt for those. And now he's getting old. He has a little bit more say in what he um, would like. So don't feel sorry for him. He has got quite a lot. But um, yeah, quite a happy mummy. Got quite a lot of stuff and I quite like it. So um, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I will be doing more hauls, but I won't be doing them every week because of course that means spending money but thanks for watching um, please subscribe if you like our videos we're really enjoying youtube thank you bye